this is Stampy, and welcome back to my Let's Play on Stardew Valley. Today's an exciting day for me and Stardew Dally. Be <laughs> in Stardew, Stardew Dally, I don't know if that sound more jolly almost. It's an exciting day in Stardew Valley <laughs> because um, I'm hoping to get my, my chicken coop. And if you have been following all of these episodes, you'll know that I have done a lot of talking about the chicken coop, but not a lot of actually getting the, the chicken coop built. I have enough money. I keep getting enough money, and then I keep getting distracted by buying hats from mice and stuff, and I keep end up losing all of my money. But I have, and oh look, oh look at all of these. Oh, what a joyous sight. Look at all of this stuff that's grown. Oh, it looks so happy. Oh, I can, I can gather all of them. What we got? We got spice berries. Oh, it's actually, it's a load of the stuff that I've been foraging anyway. Like in spring, a lot of the stuff I got were was things that I grow separately. Maybe these are things that I got from like those those mixed seeds that I got. I can't gather these pinky things yet by the looks of things, but oh, this is this is going to be one mighty payday in the morning. So not only do I already have enough for the, the coop, it also uh, means that uh, in the, the next day, uh, I'm going to have loads more spare money. So I'm basically going to be probably almost back to, to where I was. So yeah, I spent a couple episodes just kind of just fishing and watering, tending to the crops. Also, I built the, the fence around the outside and I helped organize my chest a little bit more. So yeah, progress has been a continuing on. Uh, I spent just a couple days in between episodes. So yeah, let me go and get all of this uh, this stuff watered and then I'm going to head to, to Robin. And hopefully I got enough of the other stuff because I need like wood and some other things as well. So fingers crossed. I'm I'm gonna have enough. So I was on my way to, <laughs> look at the way we are now. She's like, what? Oh, she just walked through me. Yes, yeah, so I was on my way to, to speak to Robin about the coop and she's off on walkabouts. But I'm sure you're pleased with the results, huh? Like I went and spoke to her and she was like, if you need anything built at the farm, just let me know. And then just walked off. I was like, and now I'm, this is me letting you know. So I want to get the coop, but it looks like I can't. If I give her like, should I give her some flowers? I picked up some flowers. Thanks, that's really nice. So it looks like that I can't get the coop right now just because she's off on, on walkabouts. But what I could do, oh, 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 I can help Gus, bless you. Um, I'd like to put quartz above the mantle. Please deliver it in some time today. Oh, I could do that. Do I, do I have quartz? I, I think I might have quartz just in my chest at home anyway. But yeah, what I was gonna say is, I don't think I'm gonna have enough wood. I've only got 30 wood because I made all of my fences. I don't know if I got enough wood and I think I might need some stone, but I probably have enough stone already for the coop. So I might need to go and just cut down some trees and stuff anyway. I just gotta really resist buying more seeds <laughs> because all of that stuff's just grown. But let's see, do I have the, the quartz? I don't got loads of quartz. Let's just go and take uh, all of these. And let's go and deliver these to, to Gus then. So, where does Gus live? Swayshi, where does Gus live? Do you know Gus? He's in the saloon. He's in the saloon, right. Oh, He's yeah. Like, no, I get confused. Okay, well, let me check. So, Squashy thinks, I don't know how much you can hear her. Squashy thinks Hello? that he might be in the, the saloon. Let's go check the, the saloon. Because that'd be annoying. it's annoying when I just can't find them. Or, like, they have the place where they normally are, but then they've just wandered about like Robin. Are you Gus? This is Gus? Okay, right. It's good to have my, my wiki on the other side. Oh, that's the quartz I requested. Let's see, here's what I owe you. And I get lots of money. Oh, what's this? I'd like to... Oh, why didn't it let me get the reward? Oh, there we go. Got the, the reward. Not actually that much money. I could buy a few seeds. Like, it's 3,000 gold I need for the coop. So if I'm... If I look, no, don't tell me off. Like, if I'm really, really careful and buy just enough seeds... But don't go over over that, then it'll be oh it'll be okay. Summer seeds available. So what haven't I grown then? I don't think I got um tomato seeds, do I? Pepper seeds, wheat. I didn't get any wheat and stuff. Poppy seeds. Let's get should we do some wheat? Like, they're pretty cheap, so it'd be pretty manageable. And look, I can just see how much money. My money kind of goes down in real time. So I can go and get like I get 20 wheat seeds. And then I'll get some... I'm going to be careful here. And I'll get a few tomato seeds. I'm being very... I'm going to stay over 3,000. Don't you worry. There we go. That, that'll be enough. 
Let's not go crazy. But seen as I just like harvested a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, is Robin, was she going to that like exercise class in the back of Pierre's shop? Is that what she was doing? Is that the reason I can't get my coop? Because Robin's doing her exercise class. So it might work out okay. Because I do think I need to gather some wood anyway. So I'm going to go back to the farm. I'm going to plant all of this stuff. I'm going to probably cut down some more trees as well. And then once that's done, I'm going to go back to, to Robin's little buildy place. And hopefully she's going to be there and I'll be able to get this coop done. Okay, got pretty late in the day. I haven't gone back to, to Robin yet, but I planted all of this stuff. And I've just been cutting down trees because I think that I just don't have anywhere near enough wood. And so I was trying to gather loads up. I had to eat like loads of my spicy berries or whatever they were that I just grew. But yeah, my energy was going right down. So I think I'm going to go and speak to Robin in the, the morning. And oh, oh, my foraging's gone up. My axe proficiency's gone up. That's good. That is perfect because I'm going to be cutting down loads of trees. And I can make a charcoal kiln and I can craft wild seeds. Okay, that's cool. I wonder if I can just make my own seeds now. How much money? Oh, I didn't get that much, actually. I don't think I grew the best stuff. I don't think I should have gone for the, the sweet pea and the berries. I think those might have been the things that I got given for free though. So that's why they're not worth so much. That's still quite a lot of money. That's still good. I don't want to be moaning, but considering when like I opened the door and just saw all of the color and all of the flowers and everything growing there, I was like, oh, it's so much, but didn't actually get me too much money, but I still got enough of the coop. And this is coop day. No matter what, I'm going to end today with a coop. <laughs> I'm going to try to. If Robin shows up to work rather, rather than going to exercise classes in the, the middle of the, the day, I should get the, the coop. But Squashy said that she thought it was um, 400, would you need? In my head, it was 300. But I don't know why I think that that's just what I thought but I got a letter Tomorrow we're all gathering on the beach for the annual pelican town low low la lu luau, luau. <laughs> The highlight of the event is the communal patluck Make sure you bring something good to contribute. Potluck. The governor himself, potluck. The governor himself is attending the event. So make sure you're on your best behavior. Come to the beach sometime between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. Mayor Lewis. So I need to bring something to contribute. I could bring one of these spicy chilies, maybe. I mean, I haven't really got anything fancy to, to contribute. I, I'll bring something. Oh, no, it looks like these, these pink things. Are these growing? Oh, not quite yet. They're nearly there, but not quite yet. And have these things grown? These haven't grown yet. That's going to be the big payday, I think, when all of these stuff grows. And this is my my second uh, crop of hot uh, peppers I've been able to, to get. They've already grown before. So this is all of the, the wheat uh, along here. I kind of just spread out in rows. I love the way I was supposed to be like... Like, the, the aim was the start of summer is when I get organized. And, like, look how much of a mess the farm is. It's more of a mess than it was before. Should probably put some scarecrows up this end as well to protect some of this stuff. So, right. Let me go and get a bunch of watering done. I'm going to go and cut down a load more trees. And then I'm going to go to, to Robin and find out exactly how much stuff it is that I need to, to get my, my chicken coop. Okay, I just watered all of the plants. I gathered a bit more wood, so I got 200 wood. I'm just going to go and speak to her, see if she's actually there, and just see exactly how much wood and stone that I need. I thought I'd have way more stone than I do. I've got like 191 stone. I thought I'd have loads from like my mining adventures. I'm getting a little bit more, more worried about coop day, but at least she's here. So it's, oh, it's, it is 300 wood. I was right. And then 100 stone. Oh, sorry. I, I need 100 more wood. And oh, it's 4,000 gold. It wasn't 3,000 gold. That's so lucky. Oh, if I didn't have enough gold after buying those seeds, I would have burst into tears. Luckily, I kind of ended up getting more money than I expected. And I do so have enough money so I need a hundred more wood and then that's going to be enough for me to, to get my chicken coop you have no idea how excited I'm going to, to be to just, just have like something else to do in the, the farm because I got my my crops and they're fine they're they're doing all right but it'd be nice to have something like extra something bonus um what there was isn't there like a shortcut to get back to the farm I never remember where it is because you know there's like that weird path like up the the left I never really go up there, but uh, yeah, I guess I should do. So right then, let's cut down some more trees. That's not too many more trees, but I just don't have much energy. The thing that drives me crazy is that you wake up in the morning and you water all of your crops and then that's like over half your energy gone. And obviously, you know, it depends on how many crops you have and eventually you're going to get sprinklers and stuff. But I just feel like 
compared to battling in the mine and like battling enemies and cutting down stone and stuff like I feel like that should take more energy than just doing this with a watering can like how how heavy is the the watering can but oh well all right let's go and start cutting down these trees so how many do you get like from each tree because you can cut down the tree and then the stump as well that's what I've been doing so I don't want any of these to grow back because it's good because for so long I've been needing to clear my farm like it's been a mess for so long I'm sure most people get here clear out all of the mess and then start building i've i've been continually saying i'll leave it for for later and later and later but then like a whole season pass and it's all still here so it's probably a good idea to start clearing this but there we go that's like 240 already i'm gonna have to eat something so i've saved that i've saved that chili down there that's for the, the that lucky pop thingy, whatever it was, the, the thing that we're doing tomorrow. So I'm going to save that, but my energy is still really low. I, I could make some field snacks, actually. Do I? I think I just need some, like, pine cones on me, and then I'll be able to make some field snacks. Yeah, because my hunger is really, really down right now. Is that a pine cone down there? i got to be really careful. I don't want to lose my energy. Oh, there we go. Just found a pine cone. That was so lucky. There we go. Let's make a field snack. These are the, the most nourishing of all of the, the food in the, the world. But I want to save my chili. Actually, they did all right, actually. That did pretty good. And how am I doing four for wood? I got uh, 260. I'm getting, I'm getting pretty close to, to having uh, enough. And I think... Can you like, you can shake trees in order to, to make pine cones fall for them as well. Because making some field snacks would be good. I don't, oh look, another one just fell down. I think I just need to go for the right type of tree. I think it's this type of tree down here. If I just mainly go and cut them down, then I should be able to get a, a few more field snacks. Because I got 285. I am so close to getting my coop. If Robin goes for a wander by the time I get back there, I'm going to burst into tears. Because I, <laughs> I wanted this coop for like forever and I just haven't been able to get it all of this time and I'm so so close what have I got 285 wood there's all wood on the the floor down here and another pine cone as well oh two more pine cones good let's go make a uh, a couple more field snacks as well uh, just to, to get my my energy up I need one more I need one more bit of wood and then I have enough right I just like cut down anything here I just cut down one of these there we go I got it I got enough wood Come on, chicken coop. Come on, chicken coop. So, I don't know how it works once I got the chicken coop. Am I going to need to buy... I guess I'm going to have to buy a bunch of chicken feed. And I'm going to have to buy the chickens themselves and stuff. Okay, it's not going to be, like, just easy money. But... It's going to be an exciting thing for me to have. Oh, let's go. Let's go and try and go that other route that I said about. I want to be quick. So I don't want Robin to, to go for wonders. Yeah. Where does this path lead to? I did it like ages ago. Went up here before. And there's loads of stuff on the side of the, like the path up here as well for me to gather. It looks like there's, there's not too many goodies for, for me. Like a really good tip is just to, to always just wander around like the town like once you've watered your plants and stuff just wander around and just gather things like just you know pick up stuff on the side go down to the the beach and gather things there and ah that's where the path goes from it is kind of hidden up the the top up there yeah go down the beach pick up all the chairs no robin you stay there you stay there no get back get no get, why are you still no robin no i'm not letting you leave i'm not you know you can't leave i'm gonna stay here i'm not letting you leave i this is coop day no robin come back this is chicken coop day why you were literally right there where are you going i was just daydreaming about some carpentry projects speaking of carpentry projects robin i have one for you oh there's some little some little things i gather from down here i got a a prehistoric tool oh maybe i could tell gumper about that in the museum no look robin what are you t are you just standing here really really robin Oh, please. Are you doing okay? No, I'm not because this is chicken coop day and you're ruining it for me. What? <laughs> I can't believe my timing. Literally, look, I showed up and she was behind the counter ready to take orders. I walked to the desk and she's like, ah, good time to stand at the cliff. Let's go. <laughs> I can't believe that. I can't believe the time. Like, if I showed up and she just outright wasn't there, I'd be like, okay, fine. She's doing her exercise at Pierre's shop or whatever. But this is just like, she's just standing here. You're just standing here. Right, I've never given you any presents again, Robin. I just don't like you anymore. Chicken coop day is over. Chicken coop day is ruined. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we can have chicken coop day tomorrow. I guess it's not the end of the world. It's just not the way. It's not the way I dreamed my chicken coop today. You know, when I was a young boy on the farm, you know, dreaming of chicken coop day as every young boy does. I just thought everything was going to go exactly the way I wanted. And Robin has just messed it up for me. But... We have that other party. Well, let's go. Let's go down to the museum then. We still got a little bit of time today. Hopefully, oh, the museum's going to be closed as I arrive there. 
Like, it's just a bad luck chicken coop day. Let's see if we can get there quick. And maybe it's open until, like, 8 or something? We could get... Oh, no, I think that... Oh, that that's the guy leaving from the, um, the, the blacksmith. I think the museum might stay open a little bit later. So I got some stuff. Uh, oh no, 6 p.m. Oh, I wasn't that too late. Uh, so yeah, let's go and sort out our, our inventory because it's been a little bit messy at the moment. I got my chili for the, the lucky pot thing for tomorrow. I'm going to keep all of the, the stone and wood on me as well. So maybe, maybe we can get chicken coop and get, get chicken coop. <laughs> the farmer lifestyles changing the way I talk. Get the chicken coop and then maybe just celebrate the, the party. Maybe this is for the best and it's going to make chicken coop day even more special. Okay, it's a brand new day. Uh, let's go down to the beach this way. So yeah, uh, hopefully this will be chicken coop day and chicken coop day won't be a complete failure. But yeah, that party has started down at the, the beach. So I think we should show up at uh, the, the party first. Seems as that's like a, a special day. I love why this is supposed to be like one of the, the big events that happens in this season, but I'm more excited about my own chicken coop day. <laughs> I was so excited. I want a farm like this. I want all animals. I mean, I know I understand they're not chickens. Don't think that I think that cows are chickens. Don't worry about that. But I want animals wandering around my farm. I mean, cow day, that is going to be an exciting day. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Let's not go crazy now, everybody. <laughs> yeah, so let's go and find out what this, um, yeah, what this, uh, this party is. Apparently it's going to be like a, like a Hawaiian style party. It's going to be quite exciting. Like, I kind of knew what was up with like things like the egg festival and that, but this seems very different. And oh, this is cool. I didn't expect it was going to be this fancy. Well, let's not speak to Lewis, because whenever, whenever we speak to Lewis, like, whatever the party is kind of just starts. This is tiring, honey. Are you ready to visit the buffet table soon? That that sounds like me. <laughs> don't want to dance, just go to the buffet table. I would dance, but I don't want to get sweaty. Perfect weather for a beach party, huh? Uh, one year, Sam put a pound of anchovies in the potluck soup. Oh, it's a soup. Oh, lucky I bought food. Lucky when he said, like, bring something nice. Lucky I didn't bring, like, ah, I brought you a nice pile of wood or something. Like, <laughs> let's add it in. So do I need to add something into, into the potluck? Oh, it's going to be disgusting. If you brought something for the soup, climb on the stairs on the other side and throw it in. Right, I got my... Oh, how do I do it? Ah, okay, I just let... Right, I got my, I got my hot pepper. <laughs> Hopefully everyone can handle hot food. <laughs> You added a hot pepper to the soup and it was like a hot pepper with a star as well Which means it's gonna be like extra extra spicy. Hopefully everyone's gonna be able to handle it and won't be angry at me How's farming coming along? It must be a busy season for you. It is actually I woke up late Stepped out of the door and found myself in the middle of all this hubbub. Oh, yeah He lives like a here doesn't he? I hope he doesn't mind the the noise. All right, let's go speak to, to Lewis Oh, the mayor is here as well. Oh, he might be the last person I haven't met yet the governor uh, what a lovely occasion. It's always a joy to visit Stardew Valley. Are you my last person? Oh, I can't bring up the the journal right now. He might be my last person. Look, Sharp, the governor's here for his annual visit. I know, I just spoke to him. If you brought something for the potluck, make sure to add it into the soup cauldron. I did. Okay, now what? Do, do we eat it? Do I, do I get to eat some of it? What's the deal now? Here's Gus. These blasted sand flies keep landing on the food. How do we, do, do we eat it now? I want to eat it. Maybe if I speak to, to Lewis again... Uh, should we move forward? Uh, the governor seems a little hungry. Yeah, let's go and get started then. Let's go and get started and eat the, the pot. Like, I love the way I added a really spicy hot pepper to it. <laughs> Everyone's going to be like breathing fire and fainting on the, the floor. <laughs> well, folks, it's time once again for the potluck ceremony. I trust that you all put your high quality ingredients in the pot this year. We don't want the governor to regret his visit to the valley. I did. I put my highest quality hot hot pepper. Well, Governor, would you do us the honor of tasting the soup? Hopefully he likes spicy food. Of course, I've been looking forward to this all year. Please like it. Please. It doesn't look very tempting, does it? It looks like sludge. Enjoy your sludge, Governor. Oh, no. Oh, no, his face. That's not a promising face. Does he like it? Hmm. I don't have much to say about this. It's an average soup. What? I put my good pepper in it. And he was just saying, is it now? Maybe I should have saved like a really special one. Right, Lewis is going to have a sip as well. Let's see if he likes it. He's right. It's nothing special. Not bad, though. I mean, to be fair, if everyone just threw random ingredients in, the fact that it's not disgusting is a bit of a miracle in my eyes. Who else wants some soup? I don't really like the idea of like everyone just... <laughs> digging in either. The soup was just average. But otherwise, the... 
But she was a code. Luau. Otherwise, the luau was a success. <laughs> Time to head home. Didn't even get my chicken coop. Didn't even get a chance to get my chicken coop. What an absolute failure. And didn't get anything from that. What's it called? Luau. I didn't get anything from the luau either. I don't know why I can't remember that name. What a shame. What a waste. What a rubbish day. What an, what an overall rubbish... I mean, I had fun, I guess, but overall rubbish day in Stardew Valley today. All of the um, the flowers on that look quite pretty, so I guess it's going to be tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be the new chicken coop day. But on the bright side, everything's ready. I got the money, I got the materials, I got everything that I need. Assuming she's there, I can just go straight to Robin in the, the morning and finally get my, my chicken coop done. But next year, for the... The luau, I'm going to go and save like an amazing ingredient and I'm going to blow the governor's hat off with how tasty the soup's going to be. But it's bedtime now. It's 11pm. So time for me to go to sleep, which means it's also the end of this episode here. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed it. There'll be a new Stardew episode coming up very soon. So hopefully you're going to enjoy that. But for now, thanks for watching and I will see you all later. Bye!